Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue whenever your SSD is not showing up in your Windows PC, especially the newest one. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. Right click on start menu and choose the option device manager. Here you need to expand your disk drive. Here if you have attached an SSD, it will be shown right over here. All you need to do is to right click and choose the option update driver. Choose the second option and again choose second option. Choose the latest driver and hit the next button to continue installing drivers into your system. Once it is done, do the same process with storage controller also. Expand and proceed with the same process with both the controllers available over here by right clicking and choose the option of updating driver. And one more thing friends, if you have plugged in any external devices such as mouse, keyboard or another hard disk, make sure you unplug each and everything except your newest SSD and then try to update the driver as I am showing right over here. If this method failed, let's proceed with the next step. Right click on start menu and choose the option computer management. Here click on the option disk management and here in this pane the disk will be shown right in front of you. Sometimes the issue with the letter which is conflicting with the drives and hence your SSD is not showing. So right click on your drive and choose the option change drive letter or path. Now here click on the option change. Now here from the drop down list I suggest you to choose the last one to avoid any kind of conflict with other drive letters and hit the ok button. Once it is done your letter will be changed and your disk will be shown right in front of you in your this PC option. If this method also failed, let's proceed with the next step. Click on the start menu type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Type here a simple command which is msdt.exe space hyphen id space device diagnostic and hit the enter key. Now click on the next button and it will automatically detect the problem regarding your hard drive and will fix the issue automatically. Just wait for a while until this process completed for you. As it is already saying restart your PC to finish installing. Simply click on the option apply this fix. This will restart your PC and fix out the issue for you where your SSD is not showing up. Now if this method also failed let's proceed with the next step. Again open CMD and choose the option run as administrator. Now type here disk part and hit the enter key. Now type list space disk and hit the enter key again. Now here two disks are shown. You can check by the space of your disk. First one is my main disk which can be seen right over here by checking the space which is of around 476 GB. And second one is my newly attached disk. So I type here Select disk 1 because disk 1 is my newly attached SSD. Make sure you choose the drive letter carefully else you will end up formatting your main hard disk and you will completely lost your data. Now here you need to type a command which is clean. Once you hit the enter key all the data in your disk 1 will be completely formatted. Once clean is successfully done now type here create partition primary and hit the enter key. Once partition is created, now type format fs equal to ntfs space quick and hit the enter key again. Now the disk is completely formatted using command prompt. Now close it. Go ahead and check. Your disk drive will be completely shown right in front of you as it is showing for me. Now if this method also fails, we need to take the help of a third party tool. And I suggest you to go for AOMEI partition assistant which is completely free of cost. Simply click on the option download freeware and save it into your system. After saying go ahead and install it. I have already installed and the interface would look like this. First of all, if your disk is started to showing right over here, half of your problem will be completely sorted out. Now if it is showing over here, simply right click on your disk and choose the option initialize disk. I have formatted the disk that's why the option 
to initialize is not available so at your end if initialize this option is available make sure you choose this option and this will fix the issue of ssd not showing up if initializing doesn't work out you can try to convert your disk from mbr to gpt or gpt to mbr simply just click on this disk and here you will find the option of convert mbr slash gpt click on it hit the ok button and here click on the apply option now click on the proceed option and it will convert your hard disk to mbr or gpt depending upon the type of hard disk you have once the process is completed hit the ok button your disk is now converted to an mbr disk this way you can easily fix out the issue when your ssd is not showing up in your windows pc so this is all about it friends this is how you will fix out the issue if this video works out for you i request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel thank you so much friends thank you for watching